आपका Everything seems okay there. Do you have any headaches? No. Have any worries? What do you mean, worries? Well, how do you get on with your family? Okay. How about school? Good. What about nightmares? So that's it. I thought this was just a checkup. This is just a checkup, and you're a very healthy young fella. But your father's worried about those nightmares. He's only worried because I yell a bit in my sleep and wake him up. Well, anyway, they're just dreams. Everyone dreams, don't they? Yes. Do you remember what they're about? No. Sorry. Any other problems? Yeah. Well, my father doesn't understand me. Can I go now? I guess so. Crush this. You might have to run an eye on over in the morning. All right, then. Okay, thank you. Mm. <laughs> and I'll see you after the wedding. Right. Have a good time. Yes. And tell Lorraine I'm sure she'll be a beautiful bride. Yes, yeah, she will, won't she? This is a lucky man. See you later. Goodbye. Anyway, I don't know why she's going on about it. There's not going to be any mess, eh? Yeah, better give her a ring. Probably won't get much of a chance once the guys turn up. Okay. Yeah. Any last minute message for Lorraine? No, I'm just about to ring her. Oh, good idea. Listen, don't drink too much tonight. Oh, don't worry. Good. Good eye. Scott, hold that, will you? Hey, Danny, tell Shane to get a move on, will you? Oh, yeah, okay. Hello? Is that Daphne? Yes. Hi, my name's Ramsey, Shane Ramsey. Uh, we're having a bucks party for a mate tonight. I was wondering if you'd be available. What do you want done? Oh, just a bit of dancing, you know. Well, make sure you eat. Short it. Notice. I've got another booking just before midnight. Oh, that's fine. Any time after midnight, so I can. calling for you, Shane. I'll give you the address. Did you see a doctor? Yeah. Uh huh. Great. Hello. 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 What did he say? He said I'm having nightmares. Dad didn't have to go telling him that. Come on, Danny. You won't tell us what's wrong with you. Look, what else can we do? Mum, I keep telling you there's nothing wrong with me. Danny, please. Well, I'm off then. See you tomorrow. I still think you should find time to have a decent meal. You just don't understand, do you? A bucks party takes a lot of organisation. It's got to be something old Desi will remember for the rest of his married life. Oh, yes, but why in this street? You know what your father's like about noise? We'll be so quiet, Mum. He won't even know we're in there. I promise. I want you both to drink this and get straight into bed. No chatting on till midnight. Don't worry, Mrs. Kingham. I'll make sure she gets to bed. How's Daddy? Still sulking. Oh, well, you know, Lorraine is his only daughter. <laughs> yes. Never mind. He'll get used to her being married. Good night, Julie. Good night, Mrs. Kingham. Sleep well, darling. Good night, Mum. Tomorrow is meant to be the happiest day of your life, remember? 
I just wish Daddy liked him, that's all. <laughs> the thing is that you love him. That's all that matters. Mm. You know, Lorraine, I really admire you. Nothing your father can say is going to change your mind. You love Des. And look, so many girls get married, you know, and they're not really sure. But then look, look at us. When I was going out with Des, you know, I just knew. I just knew he was not right for me. But, and then you started at the bank and you just knew. Why wasn't he right for you? Oh, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Well, he isn't really a spunk, is he? I mean, you know, he's nice. He's ordinary. Um, he'll make a great father, for sure. He's a little bit set in his ways, and um, I suppose that's a good thing. Although... Although what? Lorraine, look what we're both doing. We're picking on poor old Des to pieces the night before the wedding. No, 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 no. You love him. I mean, he's one of my best friends. You're going to be our neighbours and we're going to live happily ever after. Yeah. Daddy hates him, you know. Mm, I know. Oh, well, but you know, he isn't the one that has to love, honour and obey him, is he? You know, Lorraine, oh, I just hope that when I get married, that I love my guy as much as you must love Des. <laughs> yeah. It's still engaged. Oh, please, Lorraine, it's two o'clock in the morning. I just want to talk to him, that's all. Yeah, it's all right. Well, you can talk to him later. Look, I know exactly what he's done. He's taken the phone off the hook so he can have a really good sleep. 